Today, we're going to take you on a journey to one of Arizona's hidden gems, Mount Lemmon in Tucson. So strap in because we have a lot of ground to cover. I'm Ken Nelson, your local Tucson realtor. If this is the first time to my channel, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you'll be the first to see my new weekly video. Mount Lemmon is named after botanist Sarah Plummer Lemmon and is a part of the Santa Catalina Mountains. Rising majestically to an impressive height of 9,157 feet due to its elevation, Mount Lemmon experiences a unique climate. As you ascend the mountain, the temperature drops and the vegetation changes. It's like traveling from the Sonoran Desert to the Canadian Rockies in just a short drive. With temperatures on Mount Lemmon averaging 20 to 30 degrees cooler than Tucson, it's the perfect place to beat the heat. On the day that we went up the mountain, it was 96 degrees at the base and 65 degrees at the top. And in winter, expect temperatures to dip below freezing, so make sure to bundle up. The mountain is home to some fantastic hiking trails, ranging from easy strolls to challenging treks for experienced adventurers, and Mount Lemmon also boasts an extensive network of mountain bike trails. But if you're up for an extra challenge, consider cycling your way up the mountain. The Mount Lemmon Highway, also known as the Catalina Highway, is a popular route for cyclists seeking to test their endurance. It's an epic climb with breathtaking scenery at every turn. The Mount Lemmon Highway stretches for approximately 27 miles from the base to the top of the mountain. As you pedal your way up, you'll ascend over 6,000 feet in elevation. The sense of accomplishment you'll feel as you reach the summit is truly remarkable. A local insider's tip is to start pedaling right at dawn so you can beat the traffic on the way up and since you got such an early start, you will also miss the traffic on the way down. Mount Lemmon isn't just a summer destination. In the winter months, the mountain transforms into a winter wonderland. Snow blankets the landscape, making it a perfect playground for winter activities, from skiing and snowboarding to sledding and snowshoeing. There's something for everyone. The ski lift continues to run into summer and offers a 30 minute view from the top. After a full day of adventure, you'll surely work up an appetite. So make sure to explore a couple fantastic places to grab a bite. Check out local favorite, the Cookie Cabin. Indulge in that oven baked pizza topped with your favorite ingredients. And here's the best part. They also serve oversized warm cookies with old fashioned vanilla ice cream on top. For those seeking a hearty meal, head over to the Sawmill Run Restaurant. This place has it all, from burgers to great desserts. Dine in the casual restaurant or visit the bar for a drink and engaging conversation. If you need to stock up on provisions or grab a refreshing soft drink, make a pit stop at the general store. They have a variety of basic provisions to meet your needs, and you can also satisfy your sweet tooth with their homemade fudge. If you want to stay the night, you will have plenty of options from six campgrounds to vacation rentals to the Mount Lemon Lodge opening in July of 2023 or the Mount Lemon Hotel where guests can experience individual cabins with dedicated private entrances and all the necessary amenities for a cozy stay. The fully equipped kitchens allow guests to prepare their own meals and pet owners will be pleased to know that Mount Lemon Hotel is pet friendly. Thanks for joining us on this journey up the mountain. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Also, first time to the channel, please subscribe, click that notification bell, and until next time, keep exploring.